Hello. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to design an interactive Instagram story poll in Canva. So the first thing I'd like you to do is to launch your Canva web account, which of course I have done right here. And then the next thing we're going to delve into today's text, which is pretty much simple, how to design an interactive Instagram story poll in Canva. Now let's get right into it. This is my homepage, right? And this is what it looks like. Pretty amazing. We have some stuff going on already. So there are two ways to go about this. Number one, you either create a design from scratch, okay, by clicking on this create design button at the top right corner, or you head over to the search bar and search for amazing a wide array of templates that could help you, you know, inspire your creative processes. So from this search bar, I'm just going to say, or I'm just going to type in Instagram story poll. And I'm going to punch the enter, the enter key right here on my keyboard. And right here, you see, we have a lot of templates. So this Instagram story poll templates. Okay, so we're looking for an interactive one that we can replicate as you can see some of the designs are labeled pro it means you have to upgrade your plan for you to access this designs but if you do not have the premium version then you cannot access the designs requirements on them so what kind of poll do we want to create and how interactive or creative can we make that be so let's look for something free and beautiful all right so this is it um when it comes to your okay so answer below and then you have that so we're just looking for something really beautiful okay i think this is really interactive okay so i'm just gonna click on this so this or that kind of poll so we want people to choose between this or that so just go ahead and click on this customize this template and it takes you to the canva studio So here it goes, Studio is loading up and all the elements are just going to be here in a few. So this is a this or that kind of thing. From here where you have this slider, you can make it bigger so that you can have a better view of what this is. Okay, so right here you can of course change this image to something different. So let's say I, I have a picture. say we have a book cover design I just want to quickly download them okay this design looks cool all right so I'm just gonna place it this and save and look at this other one so I'm just gonna save and save so i'm gonna head over to canva so here i want to upload two books interactive head over to this left corner you can see upload so just click on upload and then head over to upload files and i'm gonna upload what i recently downloaded so these two open them up and you can see that they're they're here so that you're just gonna come into my canvas studio so here there so i'm gonna change this right i'm gonna take this right here so just hold and like hold one hand hold your mouse and use the other finger right there or the other hand to hold the left corner of your mouse so and then just drag and drop you can see that has changed so this one just repeat the same process one hand on your mouse one hand on the left corner of your mouse so just hold it so you can see that has been placed so i say this or that that's pretty cool so if i want to change this text all i have to do is just click on it so double click and you see it's highlighted so you can change it to let's say Mm. 
right or left. So here you have um, this book. So double click and so we have, let's say book one and I come over here, double click and I have book two. So insert poll and sticker here. So insert poll sticker here if you want this. I don't want this so I can just click on it and click on this bin or I click on this and you have this three dots menu here that shows you a wide array of options that you can choose from but I don't need any of that I just want to get rid of this so I'm gonna delete that and convert it to slider take it backwards to see what my stuff looks like so this is a really amazing poll right I can just save it and share it to my people on Instagram you can share directly to them on my story and you're definitely going to choose and respond to this so how do i share head over here to the share button click on it and download so you can definitely download to have it in your systems folder or just click on instagram and that's going to take you straight to instagram so you can post it directly on instagram so remember if you want to use the text there are a lot of options that you can use right here to make your text really beautiful so this is where you change the fonts size this way change the font all right so just this is just pretty much it so you can go over this tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and of course once you're done you'll be good to go i hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search by the way you can also change the background right of this design you can change the color just click on it and then head over to the background color and then change it to something else all right or you can use the colors from the pictures and Think this is cool you're good to go you can get rid of all of these designs here if you want to move them oh yeah all of these elements they are all movable they are all editable which makes camera really sweet so once again i hope this tutorial marvelously helps you search